Hi, it's Kevin Lobates here, and in the previous video I gave a technical description of how these two-factor authentication uh, code generators work. So I thought I'd provide an analogy that hopefully will help people with not such a technically minded approach to things to understand how they work. So imagine that you and I want to have a code that we can use when we're talking over a uh, chat messenger or over the phone to verify that it really is me that you're talking to. So what we do is uh, we agree in advance that we're going to use a random book that we pick off a bookshelf. The same book, the same edition, so that it's exactly the same thing. So uh, let's say that you and I decide that we're going to use uh, Catcher in the Rye by J.D. Salinger first edition and we both have that book on our bookshelf. Then what I do to prove to you that it is me is when I call you up I look at the time that I call you and I use the minutes to turn to a page so let's say it's 17 minutes past 3 when I call you so 17 minutes past means I go to page 17 um, uh, it's past 3 so I go three lines down and then the first thing I say when I call you is the first word on that line and you, when you get the call from me, can fish out your copy of the same book. And because I call you at 17 minutes past three and we both have time synchronized phones because the cellular network looks after that, you will also go to page 17, third line, and you'll look at that word. And if the word that I immediately said when I called you matches that word on that line, then you know that it's really me. And the key thing is that we have to make sure that nobody else knows what book we're using. And uh, if we um, do that, then we have a shared secret that allows me to authenticate your, uh, myself to you um, in an extra secure way. And that's really kind of how um, two-factor authentication works in a sort of practical sense. Um, I hope that clarified some things. Um, ask any questions below if you have any more queries. I'll uh, see you in the next video soon. Bye for now.